everybody, it's Sincerely Rue. I'm here with another video and today I'm doing the It's My Hair Tag. And hopefully doing this It's My Hair Tag video, some of your questions will be answered. So let's jump right into it. Question number one. Why did you start your hair journey? I started my hair journey because I was tired of my hair not growing. Like I was sick of it, it grew like maybe the most here when I had a relaxer. I've been getting a relaxer since I was like 10 years old and I was watching the Cosby show and it was an episode where Rudy had her afro out and it was long and it was just like, oh my God, it was so pretty. So I was like, oh man, if I didn't burn my hair, my hair would have been that long. I wanted my hair back, plain and simple. How long have you been on your hair journey? The last relaxer that I had was in October 2011. It was like six months beforehand before I had got the perm. And my hair was really thick and it was kind of getting long. And then when I permed it, it got all flat and lifeless and my hair came out and it was short. I was so mad. I have been on this journey though for about, it is 2015, so I guess I'll say four and a half years now. The next question is, are you natural, relaxed, or transitioning? You know the answer, I am a natural. <laughs> what is your hair length now? Um, I didn't officially like take a ruler to my head and measure it, but if I pull it for you guys, uh, I don't know if that'll work. That's the back. This is how long the sides are, roughly kind of round. I have layers, so that's basically how my hair is. But in the in the back of my hair it's kind of just above where the back of my bra strap is it's kind of like like two inches above that what is your goal length okay my goal length i want it to hit here while it's in its curly state like i just want it to be cascading over my shoulders the next question is health or length health if you could only live with one hair product what would it be Shea Moisture's Curly Hand Smoothie, it needs that. It needs all that loveliness. It needs it. <laughs> What's the worst product you ever used? Cantu. Cantu leave-in conditioner. Yes, I said it, Cantu. I know a lot of you naturalistas love Cantu, and granted, when I first became natural, I loved it too because number one, it wasn't expensive. Number two, it smelled great. And number three, it was very moisturizing. It was too much product buildup. It left gunk in my hair. My hair was, it kind of looked ashy sometimes. And then, um, yeah, I didn't like it. And it kind of left my hair a little waxy. What is your go-to hairstyle? My go-to hairstyle is a twist out. Are you a product junkie? Yes. How often do you trim your ends? I don't really have a time frame, but I would say every three to four months because that's when I will start to see I have like little knots and stuff. That's a sign if you're a natural. Once you get like little knots at your ends, that means that you need to trim. How often do you use heat? Not often. I don't really use it often. Um, during the winter, winter time though, I did blow dry it maybe twice a month I will blow dry because my go-to hairstyle in the winter time was a blown out my blown out curls and I will link the video here so you could see it and that was my go-to style like I just loved it in the winter do you take supplements I used to take biotin I used to take biotin pills um, it does work it did help but like after a while it just starts to break me out so I kind of stopped using it. Favorite oil? Coconut. Coconut oil. Love the smell. Love the way it makes my hair look. Coconut. <laughs> That's my favorite oil. Who is your hair crush? Oh my god. That is so hard. That is hard. Oh my god. That is hard. Can I have more than one crush? But on top of my head Every, if you're in a natural hair community, you know who Natural 85 is. You know her. <laughs> I think we all do. She, she's the reason why I actually decided 
to go natural. Her and uh, Long Hair Don't Care 2011, make sure you rest in peace. They were the two girls that was like, okay, I gotta do it. How long does it take you on wash day? Oh God, the day that I dread. Ugh, but it takes me about two hours in total. Two and a half, depending if I'm if I'm doing like small twists like this, after I wash my hair, oh, it's taking me like three hours. Worst thing that ever happened to your hair? Let me tell you. I, was, I had cornrows in my hair. And they kind of got, you know, they kind of got itchy. You know, you got other, you got weave in your hair or whatever. And I would like press, scratch my hair like this. Like, literally like that. And I took out those cornrows. That's why I had that little stupid patch in the back of my head. I was so mad. And those burns from the relaxers. I remember I had a burn right here. And I sort of like had a ball spot. Oh geez, I didn't brush my edges. So I had like this ball spot like right here. Granted, I have my hair back, but it used to be fuller than that. Do you dye your hair? If so, what color? My favorite question. I love hair color. So, um, I did color my hair. You can kind of see my color in the end. This is from Clairol uh, Textures and Tones. And this is in the color bronze. Um, I actually have a video that I colored my hair. When I colored my hair this color, I also link that up there too so you guys could see that video too okay so that is it for my it's my hair tag video you can follow me on instagram at sincerely underscore rue follow me hit the subscribe button at the bottom and i have a couple more videos coming up so please be on the lookout for it so you need to subscribe to me so you can see these awesome videos i'm about to give you right <laughs> so you guys have a great day and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.